Hello, everybody. My name is John Leonard. Actually, my name is John Selzler, but uh, my middle name is Leonard after my father. And uh, I pay tribute to him that way because my mother and father inspired me so much uh, to get into music. I grew up in a household um, that had live music all the time happening. And uh, so I was bit by that music bug. And its venom has spread a lifetime. This first song was an original called Follow Your Dream.
so there you go. That's my first song. Mistakes and all. Thank you very much. <laughs> all right, I'm going to get ready for the next song here. Uh, so I don't think I did too bad on that last one. Been a while since I've done Follow Your Dream. So this next one uh, is called Blessed Days. And uh, it's just that. You know, good times, bad times. Let's appreciate what we have, this life. They are all blessed days. I don't have any fancy hardware on this one, harmonica or capos and stuff, so.
Okay, moving on to song number three, which is going to be a cover song. Yes, I do do covers on occasion. For those of you who know me, you know I've been writing since I was about 16 years old. I uh, used to sneak my dad's guitar when he was away um, and uh, teach myself to play guitar. I found, uh, that was when I was about 15, I uh, found a hand-scribbled chord chart in his case that I think he learned from, and so I learned some basic chords, and uh, shortly after just learning to get my way around with a few chords, I started writing songs and have at least 300 to my name, and all of them are hits. <laughs> yeah, right. So uh, if there was one, wouldn't that be amazing? That's all I need, just one. Um, <clears throat> but uh, this next song, moving on to song number three, is... Um, Days Like This by Van Morrison. <laughs> paging through my songbook and uh, I ran across a song that I felt inspired to play and uh, I'm going to need these to see the lyrics. But uh, it's a song that I learned to play because of a veteran friend of ours who um, stopped in at Lakewood Playhouse where um, we host 
a music jam event called Sound Vet Jam. And uh, it's just here in Lakewood, Washington, right outside the gates of uh, Joint Base Lewis McCord, practically. And um, Taco is his nickname. He stopped in and he kind of sat in the back of the theater and remained quiet, you know, spoke up on occasion. And uh, at one point he expressed interest in wanting to sing a song. And the song... Uh, was going to be a tribute to a good friend of his, and it happens to be one of Taco's favorite songs. And <clears throat> But uh, with a little bit of encouragement, he got up there and actually sang it and did a mighty fine job. Everybody was just very pleased and and um, enjoyed it very, very much. <clears throat> and the song that he want, wanted to play, or that he played, was uh, a song written by Towns Van Zant. Uh, it was made uh, popular by Willie Nelson and Merle Hager, and the song is called Poncho and Lefty. And so I'm gonna try my hand at it here. Hopefully I do a good job for you. <clears throat> but I gotta be uh, up on my chops on this song uh, so when I cross paths with Taco again, I can accompany him with it and uh, know what I'm doing. <laughs> Living on the road, my friend. Gonna keep us free and clean But now you wear your skin like iron And your breath's as hard as kerosene You weren't your mama's only boy But her favorite one it seems She began to cry when you said goodbye And sank into your dreams boy, rode a horse fast as polished steel, wore his guns outside his pants for all the honest world to feel. Pancho met his match, you know, on the deserts down in Mexico. No one heard his dying words, but that's the way it goes.
<laughs> right there it is. A little rough, but I made it through without stopping. All right, hope you enjoyed it. Get ready for the next one for you. So, long before I ever uh, had a band or started Music Works for Veterans Project, uh, this was back in the 80s actually, uh, I was serving overseas with a, with a good uh, Air Force buddy and uh, actually it's where I met this guy named John McLaughlin who turns out he's a, he's a poet and uh, we'd be in the dorm room parties and <laughs> he'd be sitting off in the corner somewhere writing and I was like, you know, kind of curious, so what are you writing? And uh, he's like, he uh, showed me a couple poems that he had and one really kind of struck me, uh, really inspired me. Uh, when, when I see something and I'm inspired, uh, I already, the, the melody's already flowing, it's already, it's already working. And uh, so I asked him, I liked it so much, I asked him if I could uh, just take a page back with me and, uh, and try a little music to it. And he was just thrilled by the idea. So I, I went back and uh, that evening I wrote, I wrote uh, the music to it and I played it for him the next day. He, uh, he, he loves it. <clears throat> and <clears throat> so this is John McLaughlin's song that um, it's called Walls of Steel. And it's an example of uh, how music has worked in my life and bring, bringing together friendships and, and, um, and just by expressing the way he did and the way I did and, and bringing it all together, it was just um, it was pretty amazing. Um, and that's kind of what Music Works for Veterans is all about because you just kind of you express and you create and you just let it out you know and so Walls of Steel is a song that John wrote uh, for his girlfriend who was back in the States and uh, it goes like this left behind darkness is up ahead my eyes are crying you know babe it's all so lonely i don't quite know what to do living just isn't the same sense i'm not living with you now the walls of my life are made of steel Oh 
you go. Walls of Steel. Wrote that with uh, John McLaughlin back in uh, 1987. And uh, a lot of people tend to like that one. I hope you do too. Thanks. I'll get ready for the next one. All right. I got another cover song I'm going to play for you. And um, I'll just play it and let you guess what it is. Cortez the killer. 
That's a Neil Young song. I don't remember hearing that on the radio for some reason, but it's a pretty popular song of his, and I hope you enjoyed. Okay, th so this next song is an original tune that um, I suspect that many of you might be able to relate to. Um, anybody who has a, uh, a loved one who was suffering the life of addiction and the struggles that come with that, you'll know what I'm talking about. Sometimes you can't always control everything. Sometimes you just have to lift it up and give it to God. It's called trust.
trust. Uh, COVID-19. You know, I don't even really want to give it the time of day, to tell you the truth, but uh, it's not going to stop me from making jokes about it. <laughs> you know, um, COVID, acronym for something. I'd say cleanse often via internal dousing. You know what that means? It means 19 shots. <laughs> anyway, um, I hope this finds you all very well and doing good. And um, hopefully you, you're able to be with your families. I know I have some friends who are not able to be with their families. And, and that's a difficult this difficult thing especially when you have illnesses in the family and um, uh, family passing away and not being able to be there with your family to support um, I just want to mention my friend Rebecca I mean she um, she can't be with her family right now and um, her uncle had passed away and so um, but we're staying in place right we got to do what we got to do I mean, it's here and it's real and we got to deal with it. <clears throat> but this next song, um, I've always liked this ever since it came out. It's a Wallflowers tune called One Headlight. <laughs> Thank you. 
Stapleton tune from the first time I've heard it. I can really relate to it too. You know, uh, that was Chris Stapleton's very first music video, 
And the producers thought he was nuts when he said he was going to make a video out of that using that song. And uh, but uh, ended up doing really well with it. He actually um, did that in a partnership with um, uh, an organization that uh, deals with mood disorders. And it's uh, very profound and very touching. And it just kind of grabs me right here because um, because I kind of know what they're talking about with that. Um, so that's all I'm going to say about that. <laughs> all right. So anyway, I hope you enjoy the tune. Chris Stapleton, Fire Away. I love that song. This next song I was inspired to write uh, when my mother passed away. And uh, actually it's a tribute to uh, both my parents who have both passed on. And also to all those who've gone before us who have made sacrifices on our behalf. And uh, this song goes out to them. And it's basically a reminder. It's not meant to be a sad song. Um, it's, uh, it's a reminder to just... Uh, on a daily basis, uh, those who are close to you, you know, hold them, hug them, tell them you love them, and um, while you're together. So it's called Those Who've Gone Away. Who've gone away 
so dear the mess that sweet and gentle kiss from those who've gone away. today. Um, this song is called My Heart is Young and it's about just that. Staying young at heart, slowing down a little bit, allowing love to enter your life um, and and experience it. Experience the magic. And uh, I wrote this song as kind of a build me up for myself because um, I was trying to remind myself of that and hence this song, My Heart is Young. I hope you like it. Another day is another way. It doesn't matter about yesterday or the hundred bills I had to pay. Get too cozy with contentment I didn't want to live a life of resentment I'm just a man with a heart and a sketchy plan Another day is another way It doesn't matter about yesterday My heart is young, I can't see it any other way
Thank you all once again for, for watching this. Um, and uh, I really do wish you well. I hope you're all well. Uh, you and your families are safe and healthy. And uh, I had a lot of fun doing this. I, I really appreciate those who, who had asked me to post some videos because you know, I just don't do a whole lot of that. I play a lot of music, but I don't, uh, I don't post a lot of video online and stuff. And, and it's usually a matter of time and editing things down. <laughs> you know, I don't have much editing, editing to do here because, uh, you know, each one of those songs, the only one I had to really retake and start over was that um, uh, Poncho and Lefty. I kind of struggled with that one at first, but the other ones were, those are all first takes for you. And, um, and I haven't played them in quite some time. So I got to cre credit myself a little bit because I'm usually very uh, critical of myself and beat myself up a lot. But uh, anyway, uh, that's how I got to be as good as I am now. And uh, my name is John Leonard, um, John Leonard Selzler. I go by John Leonard because Leonard is my middle name and it's after my father. And I pay tribute to him that way when I perform. Uh, so I go as John Leonard. I do have a band. Uh, called John Leonard Band, and um, I really miss those guys. Uh, we haven't played in quite some time, but I uh, can't wait to get back together and start uh, jamming and practicing and, and playing some gigs again. And uh, so you can find out more uh, about that. I, I got uh, some updating to do, but uh, there's uh, johnleonardmusic.com. That's the website. And there's the Facebook uh, you can find me at uh, John Leonard Music on Facebook. And uh, also, you heard me talk about Music Works for Veterans. Uh, music Works for Veterans and, and all of our events, uh, if you want to follow and, and uh, see what's happening with that. See how we're helping veterans in our community. And uh, my, co -vet, my, uh, my comrades, <laughs> my uh, fellow veterans, um, it's just, uh, that's, this is where it is for me. Uh, that I found a good place for my heart right here, helping veterans, helping people, the community through music. Uh, music is magical, music is healing. We believe in it, everybody on our team believes in it. We'll all testify towards the power of music and how it's the positive, positive effect that it's worked in our lives. So anyway, I just had to share that with you. You can find Music Works, the number four veterans.org online. And also we are on Facebook, Music Works for Veterans. Okay, so uh, please go check it out, and uh, hopefully it won't be so long before uh, I get to do this again. <laughs> so anyway, good night. Love you all. Take care.